So the reasoning behind the Independence Party is there's, there are a few reasons and uh, we've detailed them on the website. Uh, but one of the main ones is that we're seeing a centralization of power and we have been seeing a centralization of power for a fair long time now. So uh, since about the Industrial Revolution, a lot of power shifted towards London and uh, really it's left a lot of forgotten communities in the UK. So we're aiming to try and change that. It's going to be a gradual process, but yeah, one of the main reasoning is to try and bring power back to the people. You have, you have to follow the normal democratic channels. So you have to petition central government for a devolution of power. So they, they have the, the legal precedent to do it. So they, they've done it to Scotland, Wales, Northern Ireland. They even gave London their own legislative area. So we would t try and gain elected office and put pressure on the government to decentralise their power, push away from, from London. So the perfect snow, ultimately, is a sovereign Wiltshire that governs itself. But until that point, and I think that's, fair, that's fairly long down the road, so until that point, what we want to see initially is, as you said, the devolution of powers. We're going to have Wiltshire certainly at the start, the county council, give it more power. And then, because at the moment, they really just manage things uh, on a local level. They don't really have a say on the geopolitics or uh, macroeconomic situation of the country. We want to see more say in that, in that regard first. And then after that, we want to uh, try and get more and more powers over a long process uh, towards a, a fully sovereign Wiltshire. One of the things we really focus on is liberty. Um, we might not have made that clear enough, but civil liberty in this country we think is a really big issue and um, we're really going to focus on that. That's going to be one of our biggest talking points. So civil liberty really needs to be focused upon. Many governments, not just here, it's around the world, seem to put their focus on improving the country on purely economic growth. And they don't really care what happens to the people as long as the numbers are good. Um, even in the Italian election recently, that was one of the main things the new president highlighted. Um, so what we would be looking to do is, with introduction of civil liberties and the devolution of power is bring representation of people's lives back, not the numbers of their lives. So take away the, the influence of, of greedy merchant banks and, um, and, and yeah, improve people's lives in a tangible way.